Hello, I'm John Mitchell, President and CEO of IPC, a global industry association representing all facets of the electronics industry supply chain. Welcome to the third in my series of videos on policies that the Trump administration and the Congress should adopt to help boost the U.S. manufacturing sector. Recent surveys have shown that more than 80% of manufacturing executives believe there is a talent shortage in the United States. Openings for manufacturing jobs last year averaged more than 350,000 per month, and that number has been trending upward. How can the U.S. attack its critical talent shortage? By raising the educational bar across the board, from early childhood through post-secondary education, and creating a more robust network of vocational training and apprenticeship programs. From kindergarten through 12th grade, educational standards should be higher. Rather than coddling our children into mediocrity, we should raise the bar and push them to achieve. Only by building students' confidence in science and technology in their youth can we build a solid pipeline of future engineers. Beyond high school, leaders in education and business need to offer more apprenticeships and vocational training programs funded, funded and led by public-private partnerships. This model works well in Germany, where IPC members like Siemens and Bosch use apprenticeships to train their workers in advanced manufacturing. Apprenticeship programs do exist in the U.S., but on a much smaller scale. Apprenticeship USA is a public-private partnership aiming to ramp them up. Moreover, the data show that apprenticeships programs are great jobs programs. The U.S. Department of Labor reports that 87% of U.S. apprentices receive job offers upon completion of their training. And workers who have completed apprenticeships earn an average of $50,000 per year, compared to the median annual wage of around $44,000. Support for these programs will require more than just political support. It will require getting rid of the stigma that is often attached to vocational training. American students and their parents need to know that Voc ed can be a challenging path to a rewarding career. To practice what we preach, IPC established IPC Edge, an online educational and training platform aimed at developing the skills needed for our industry. For more information about IPC and our own workforce development initiative, visit our website at edge.ipc.org. To see more of these videos about IPC's policy agenda for advanced manufacturing, visit our website and click on Government Relations. Thank you for watching.